gonna be caught. They instantly managed to blow up the silencer, and they're gonna be able to go on to Ace, but he gets up this under. No, the link is blocked in. He's not able to get it off. He's gonna have to try for round two here. His second life, BKB already activated, toss up in the air, and actually his resolution instead. Looking to be able to slow down Ace on the side, though. Mid one is going for the Ogre, but it's Ace who's more important to activate his... Uses uh, the refresher, uh, refresher. Uh, turns around, can't manage to get off the Sunder, but Stay King with the Ghost Scepter will be able to dodge a lot Rezo, of... Rezo, he's got the Divine! Just can't get away! He's got the Divine Rapier! Everything to be able to save Rezo right now, but he's hit by the Stomp. Can they catch up to him? Here comes Yapstor, laying damage into Resolution. He needs two more swipes, one more. The body block who you are, the long range toss. They get him with Ace, he's dead. No buyback, only Snake King can do it now. MSS falls, but the damage, it's all gone for VGJ Storm and Team Secret. March in with three heroes, but they're a little bit timid. They know it's a three versus three, and they just got a massive win being able to take away that Divine Rapier off of the Dusa. And now it comes to mid one. Lack damage no longer. So he's gonna go for the high ground here. They have so much range on these heroes. Ace has that meta up for just a little bit longer. And he's got the multi-shot too for the clings. So he is ready to lay out so much damage. Can VJ Storm possibly hold this for a full minute? The swap back in on a sinking. Hex instantly taken away. Does manage to get a good terrorize in. The Bedlam follow-up, but it's not quite enough. Mid one has plenty of HP to be able to work with, and thanks to the Stomp, Snaking is gonna come in. He tries to go for Yaptor instead. Yule Scepter on MSS, but look at this damage coming out from Mid White. Just two shots with Sinking falling as well. That's the end of the game. Team Secret will 2-0 VGJ Storm and keep themselves alive here at the International. What a comeback. They could have just held the high ground, but instead they go for the buybacks, they play for the win, they play for the throat. VGJ Storm, they will be so disappointed when they watch this game and how far ahead they were at all points of it. 21,000 gold lead, what seemed to be control of the game with the buybacks force, but Team Secret, they stand tall, they hold strong. Oh, there is no, there's no quit in this team. Absolutely not. Honestly, Team Secret, much like OG, just seem to look better and better as the tournament's going on that first game. I would say just a complete strategy win, but the execution from Team Secret, very solid in this game too. Yeah, I feel like this is what strengthens teams at TI. You need some of these games where it's going to test you, you're going to be far behind. And they stand the test. The mental fortitude for Team Secret keeps them in that game too. Unbelievable, Team Secret, man. They just had, they had such a good start to this season, too. And then seemed to falter up, but here at TI, this is the ranking, this is the only thing that matters for these teams all year long. And Team Secret will be able to keep going forward. How far can they go here at the International? For that, we ask the analysts. All right, well, that does it. There is the series two to zero. Team Secret will be moving on in the international. And